Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 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 Are you taking girls to the Bahamas? Oh, I thought you meant like my cell phone number. I was like, oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, well, you know her? Yeah. I used to date her. This is the last question. Um, What do you think is the average body count of a Columbia student? I go with 70. Bruh. Oh, so what's up, bro? How you doing? Just, nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you. Okay. Andrew, nice to meet you. We knew YouTube was gonna be the thing. I was actually working in finance uh, until I met Andrew and David, the Fung brothers. They told me about this whole YouTube idea. The song's dedicated to the shoddies. Oh my god! I'm from Princeton, New Jersey, and I'm studying environmental biology and architecture. Doylestown, Pennsylvania, and I'm studying biomedical engineering. Okay, bet. Actually, fun fact, guys, uh, me and Johnny actually went to high school together, so shout out Lawrenceville. <laughs> yes, sir. I'm from San Clemente, California, and I'm thinking of majoring in political science. From Hoboth Beach, Delaware, and I'm going to major in biomedical engineering. I'm from Irvine, California, and sustainable development. I'm from LA, and I'm studying computer science and statistics and math. I'm studying sociology, and I'm from California, so oh. First question, uh, what do you think makes Columbia uh, stand out from the other Ivies? Um, the core. <laughs> no, yeah. The core. The college core is a little different. As a college student, I have to take um, the entire core, and basically that involves like doing literature classes, uh -huh. philosophy classes, uh -huh. um, music and art classes, uh -huh. and all the students in the college will, will take those classes okay. together. So you've had to like read all, all of these? Yeah, for sure, for sure. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> and that's been around for what, a hundred years? This basic core. Okay. So it's just if you don't, if you don't like the core, don't go to Columbia College. The people that choose to come here are like certain types of people, like not the same people that go to like Cornell, which uh -huh. is like the middle of nowhere, or like uh -huh. Dartmouth, who's uh -huh. like I don't know, like you know. Uh -huh. So it's like they come here like for New York, and like that's already gets a certain type of people. So that's what uh -huh. I like. Do you, want, do you want to elaborate on like yeah, what? people are yeah. like more independent? I uh -huh. feel like driven. <laughs> because we like go off into the city, kind mm -hmm. of do our own things. Mm -hmm. Whereas like at other places, there's not quite that, that option. Go out into your environment and like learn how the world works mm -hmm. and experience that firsthand. Okay, next question. This is more for like the high schoolers watching this. Like, what do you think made you uh, stand out in high school? Whether that's like GPA, like extracurriculars. I mean, are you guys uh, willing to show your numbers? Yeah, like GPA, like I said, oh, yeah. oh, I thought you meant like my cell phone number. I was like, oh. <laughs> get, like people calling. Yeah, like, oh, like, oh. I was really confused. Uh, <laughs> my bad. Yeah. Four point oh, unweighted. Uh -huh. Four point five, weighted. Uh -huh. Three nine eight, unweighted. Four point six. Three eight five. Four point three, but we had like weighted courses. Four point six, but my school did some weird weighting. Wow. It's not as good as you think it is. Like oh. I wasn't like the best student. Yeah. I think I had like a four point one. 3.9-ish, like, okay. like that. Yeah. 1530 SAT. A 1510 SAT. ACT was a 33, mm -hmm. so yeah. My SAT was a 1520, I believe. A 1490 on my SAT. Oh yeah, I got a 36 in the ACT. I had good grades, I had a 4.0, but then my test scores weren't as good. Uh -huh. I got a 32 on the ACT. Uh -huh. Personally, for me, I was like the model UN kid, but then I also uh -huh. sing, so I like uh -huh. kind of did both. Well, I was also an, a model UN kid, but uh -huh. what I did was I lived in near Koreatown uh -huh. in LA, so I did a lot of like advocacy and activism for like Korean Americans. Mm -hmm. Throughout like my first half of high school, I did a lot of like science research, like I worked at a lab, like I did bioengineering, like I don't do that now, like not even close, I don't even take math. I also was a model UN kid. I worked on a few projects related to sustainability mm -hmm. and that like obviously like funneled into my interest in um, environmental biology. Mm -hmm. I kind of made this uh, this like college help organization and it would help like ESL students get like college resources and how to uh, enroll into college uh -huh. pretty much. All right. That's cool. Science Olympiad but also like mock trial. I'm an athlete so I was uh -huh. recruited for fencing. Okay. So that was definitely like what got me. Oh wait wait hold on. Do you know a girl named a 
Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Wait, you know her? Yeah, I used to date her. I don't know, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. She was my friend in high school. <laughs> does this song sound familiar? Wait, she's oh, my dude. Babe. Yeah, what a small <laughs> world. <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah. We all know her. Oh really? Yeah, they're all in the same sorority. Yeah. How would you like sort of describe like the dating culture? It's like more of a hookup scene, dating scene, like how'd you... Uh... That's a great one. Why don't you take this one? No, I honestly think there are a lot of couples here. Like I think there's a really strong hookup culture because like people are really busy, but I also think there are a lot of couples. Like even freshmen top here. From what I've heard, there's still like more of like hookups rather than like uh -huh. dating. Okay. Because like a lot of people have singles to like freshman year, mm -hmm. so just like... It's like screw the people on your floor. <laughs> also, I think it's just like <clears throat> the hookup culture is also different here because we're in New York, mm. which kind of broadens the opportunity because a lot of colleges it'll be like the people on campus are your pool. You pick from them, whereas <laughs> New York City's New York City. Yeah. You got NYU, you got lots yeah. of other places where you can pick from. So, you know, the people who want hookups, it's not yeah. a small pool. On a scale of one to ten, uh, how attractive do you think Columbia students are? The boys ten. the girls. The girls tan. The girls, the girls tan. Also, Women, I'm sorry, we have ordered. You have double the girls. But this is real tea, though. The ratio is up because yeah. there's a whole other school of women at uh -huh. Barnard and then you just add them to the mix yeah. and then there's just so many more girls yeah, yeah, yeah I heard about that. I'd, I'd give us like an eight. Eight? No. <laughs> a six in society is like a Columbia like 8.5 so I think that's oh, like <laughs> There's definitely a 2.5 like I've just this like going around like everyone's like if you go to Columbia you have to lower your standards. Uh, <laughs> like, I feel like that's for like a lot of I'm not gonna yeah. say my yeah. personal opinion on it but uh. I've heard a lot of people say it so it must be true. If it's you're okay. like comparing like school, it's not like like Yale it's like everyone's gonna be so much hotter right? Uh, uh, yeah. yeah. I feel like really? People are hotter 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 I've been there bro. I was there like Two days. Were the people what would hot? You say about it? Would you say that that? I mean, wait, can I just say though, like, yeah. if you don't find your the love of your life at Columbia, you also have all of New York City. Yeah, so it's like right. the people in New York City no, are attractive. It, it you know, go to like, NYU. You go to NYU. <laughs> yeah, you can go to NYU. Yeah. yeah, we go to NYU. We like go other other areas. Yeah. But um, no, I would say the men here are, are not it. What's like a memorable slash like funny slash like best way someone has like shot their shot at you? Someone took me to the Bahamas. Oh yeah, that was oh, a pretty, yeah. that was a pretty intense uh -huh. way to, yeah. Like like a stranger. On a date. Yeah, pretty really? much stranger. Yeah. <laughs> like off, off what? Like Tinder? Or <laughs> Tinder. Tinder. <laughs> Took you to the Bahamas? Mm -hmm. I can't really follow. Up. <laughs> <laughs> wait no, for free? For, wait. No, I'm not gonna for, for free. free. For free. Like our, our age or? Yep. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> nice. That's 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 pretty cool. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, are you taking girls to the Bahamas? Is the YouTube game now? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, no, I'll get there one day. But... <laughs> okay. you on that one. <laughs> this is pretty recent, you know. No shame on the guy. I appreciate the dedication, but um, just a friend, you know. Nothing leading up to it. I didn't do anything, and I came back from Puerto Rico recently. Like I was visiting home. I get to the airport and. The man is there. He searched up my flight. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, and yeah, he was exactly. at the airport Same. with oh. flowers. And, I, <laughs> and then he like, he, no, I feel really bad, like laughing at it. It was really, it no, was, no, this, it was oh. no, actually no. It was cute, but it was a little boundary crossing. Yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah the boys a little boundary yeah. crossing. Uh, you gotta respect yeah. the dedication. Yeah. I, I, respect I respect the hustle. I respect, I respect it, it but, yeah. I mean, wait, do you think that guy has potential to be more than friends? Or uh, you go... I don't know. Um, Damn, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's okay, very sweet. It just, uh -huh. you know, it was a lot yeah. at once, yeah. I would say. Yeah. This is the last question. Um, what do you think is the average body count of a Columbia student? Yeah, I'd, I'd put us on the lower end, probably. Like, between 5 and 10, I would say. By seeing what? <laughs> by we're not that wild of a school. So. We're not that wild of a school. So I'd definitely yeah. say we are on the lower end of that. Uh -huh. Yeah. Five to ten then? Yeah. It depends like what school like sees like engineering. I believe they probably all started at zero. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, <laughs> 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 I'm say all four years, definitely more than ten. Oh yeah. Really? For the average for person? Sure. Oh okay. I don't know about the average person. Oh, she I don't means know. like <laughs> oh, like okay, maybe five. Average. Yeah, okay. that sounds right. That sounds right. If you like to like meet people. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I go with 70. Okay. Wait. This is New York! Who, who, who you <laughs> no, <laughs> I'll give <laughs> Okay, okay, fine. I'll go with 30. 30? Yeah. I would guess 10. 
10. All right. Thank you, boys. Appreciate that. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. Was there anything you guys said that you want me to cut out? I mean, I don't think you guys think said anything bad. I think we did. Thank you, guys. Appreciate okay. it. Nice meeting you guys. See you, too. Oh, was there anything uh, you want me to cut, cut out or? No. Thank you, guys. Appreciate Thank it. Thank you. Wait, what's yeah. your YouTube Search up. Uh, Right. Thank you guys so much. Appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've seen the body, the yell one. Oh really? Wait, what was that? Yeah, that was yeah, that was me. I did. Yeah. See, oh, one wait, like, did you go to Harvard? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Even, I saw that video. It's so funny. Oh, you guys right. should also post it on TikTok so that it goes viral. Oh, say what's up, bro? How you doing? Just nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you. Yo, big fan, big fan, bro. Oh, thank you. Been watching a lot of the videos. Okay. Alrighty, thank you so much for letting me interview you. Uh, first question, what's your name, where you're from, and what is your YouTube channel called? Uh, my name is Andrew for the Fung Brothers. I'm one half of them. My older brother, David, and I have been doing a channel for uh, almost 10 years now, since 2011. Nelson Chan, they call me Nelly. My YouTube channel, Hoopin' Life. You know, uh, basketball, sneaker content, lifestyle vlogs, anything. So, uh, first question, you know, you started YouTube 10 years ago. Like, what inspired you guys to first start? Uh, we always wanted to do entertainment growing up. Being Asian was always an element growing up because we always felt Asian because we grew up in mostly a non-Asian area. Mm -hmm. Even though we had some good Asian friends, it was mostly not a non-Asian context. So for us, identity was something that we thought about early on. We started doing stand-up comedy and rapping mm -hmm. like early on back in college uh, up at the University of Washington. Um, shout out to all the organizations and the events out there. But uh, give us a lot of practice like retro open mic. And then, uh, yeah, I mean, we moved to L.A. and we were doing stand-up at... But really, we knew YouTube was going to be the thing that we're also doing because that was kind of blowing up at the time with Wong Fu and uh, Tim De La Ghetto and, and, and Ryan Higa and stuff. So we were like, all right, cool. Like, that's probably the way that we're going to do it. Like, you know, put ourselves out there. Like, because the whole stand up system wasn't like, just wasn't something we wanted to do at the mm -hmm. time, even though right. I tried it. Right. I think it all started with my passion with basketball. Uh, I was actually working in finance uh, until I met Andrew and David, the Fung Brothers. They told me about this whole YouTube idea. I wasn't really happy with my you know, previous job in finance, and I was just like, I was like, I wanted to do something different and do something I like, and basketball was one of it. So uh, I just, you know, I took on their offer for them to kind of teach me the ins and outs of YouTube, and, and I just went with it, started my YouTube channel from there. Oh. So, oh wow, I didn't know you guys were that close. Like, yeah, 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 oh, we, yeah. How long did it take for you to get to like 100,000 subscribers? I hit 100K in 11 months, my first 11 months. Oh, wow. Man, uh, that was a really good year. Obviously, you know, I just started. Uh, I worked my butt off, you know. What do you think are, are like the pros and cons of like sort of like doing YouTube, like becoming famous? I don't know if we're famous, man. I, I know people, I think within a certain communities, we are more well known. Okay. You want to use it for good and use it for your advantage like to get work done you know and, and get projects through and and organize people like we have some followers so we put out a call out for like yo everybody come to the park we're filming a video with nelson like uh you know it's a way to bring people together that's how we, i look at it okay yeah i mean it's it's cool i mean people recognize you they sometimes it's awkward and sometimes you're like let me reach out and not make make this less awkward uh, -huh. uh and so sometimes i i feel like doing that like stepping up and like reaching out first because I know some people are like shy oh, or whatever. Okay. Yeah, 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 but like, I don't know, we're regular people, like we're pretty accessible to okay. be honest, so. Right, right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. To me, I don't feel like a celebrity. I just feel like any other normal person, man. I'm just out here making content, having fun with people, mm -hmm. and uh, just doing what I love. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I, that's for sure a pro, you know, you get to do something you enjoy. Mm -hmm. uh, you get to inspire other people. Yeah. All right, that's basically it. Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you, Justin. Thank, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Shout out to Justin. Yes, sir. I'm out. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. Thank you, Justin. Thank you. Appreciate that. Oh.
Shot is throwing that chick. Me, I'm supporting this shit. This is a story, came from my life, and I'm just recording this shit.